I have yet to even post or edit the first Ipsy video I made for the June Glam Bag Ipsy. And uh, because I haven't watched it, I'm like, did I say what I wanted to say? I don't remember. But basically, if you're new, you probably are. I got home from college late April, saw an Ipsy ad on Instagram, and I'm like, I want to make YouTube. I want to make makeup videos, even though I don't wear makeup. I want to get into makeup. Maybe Ipsy will be good. I have some extra money. Let me go and buy Ipsy for a year. So I did. And now my tax returns haven't gotten to me and won't until like October. So I'm like, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have bought an Ipsy. I should have just bought like beginner makeup that like TikTok people say that you should get because it works. But now I'm gonna get 12 glam bags and I don't even have like foundation or anything. So I haven't completely never bought makeup before. I bought it for like eighth grade promotion and for like senior pictures. But besides that, I haven't really worn it because I'm like, I don't go anywhere. I don't have cute clothes, why would I wear it? But I'm like, you can do it anyways, do it for you. So Ipsy already from the first month is probably if you are already into makeup and you already have some things and it's just kind of like sp spice up your like daily routine. It's like salt, pepper, seasoning, garlic, whatever to your like steak, hamburger, chicken, fish, whatever. But by itself, if you don't have anything else, it's kind of like why are you just licking salt? If you know what I mean. I'm not trying to drag Ipsy or say you should never buy it. I'm just saying if you don't have any makeup, don't start out like this. Get other things. Watch videos about people who are like, if you've never done makeup before, try this out. But yeah, I was, I haven't edited that video because it's one of the things is like a skincare thing. So I was like, I was going to wash my face with it and film how that goes and I haven't done it. So now we have the July. So July 2022, soak it all in, the sun, the shimmer, the SPF, this month, savor every moment, whether it's the impromptu pool dip or self-care spa day, and leave those to-dos till tomorrow. Okay. I didn't read this last time, so let's just see. The moment you've been waiting for, five new products valued as $50 plus are yours. That's the, probably the best thing, is that you get the products for way less than they actually are. But if you like them, you can buy them again. So we have Gold Fit and MD Vital Boost Even Skin Tone Daily Moisturizer. The best skin care products are the ones that work for you. This daily moisturizer moisturizer delivers a powerful mix of ingredients to maximize moisture add this to your lineup to give your skin a fighting chance against hyperpigmentation and texture tip always use at least a nickel sized amount on the face and neck deluxe sample the msrp of the full size version of this product 50 milliliters is 68 dollars for the egg. Last time I didn't read that page and I just was like, ooh, pretty things, surprise. They got a little starfish on this bag. This is cute. Here we go. You cannot see that at all. But yeah, it's golden fade-in problem, even uneven skin tone. Vitamin D. Yeah. I don't really have a skincare routine. I just wash my face with CeraVe. Sometimes I don't even do that because I don't shower every day. But I will be better. I've gotten a lot of motion, motivation to do self-improvement and stuff. So, yeah. That will be fun to try probably get more other skin care stuff again it you should buy this if you already have some skin care stuff and if you want to get into skincare don't buy ipsy 
if you're not already into it. The next thing is a Beauty Value Eyeshadow Quad in Plum. I saw most of these things because I like got an email from Ipsy and like, this is what's in your bag. So I was like, okay. So I kind of already knew what was in it. So I knew this was in that. I didn't really look at the other things, but love a bold eye look? Then you'll definitely love this eyeshadow palette from Beauty Value. Vault? Beauty Vault. I need to go back to college. I'm losing how to read. It's filled with four highly pigmented matte and shimmery shades so you can create an array of eye looks for day and night like a pro. Tip, dampen your makeup brush before applying these shadows to dial up the intensity. Full size MSRP, $18. That's fun. I love that they give you little tips because like I don't know anything. But here we go. Let me just... pretty fun colors. They kind of look like the ones my sister has. That's kind of fun. I don't have a brush. The new Co Barrier Culture Cleanser. Simplify your cleansing routine with this ultra gentle yet highly effective face wash. It's soap free. Okay and sulfate free so it won't strip your skin, removes dirt, pollution, and makeup, and it helps fortify your skin barrier with a blend of prebiotics, probiotics, and postbiotics. Tip massage one dime sized dollop over damp skin and rinse clear with warm water. Deluxe sample the MSRP of this full size version of this product, 120 milliliters, is $42. Skincare is expensive, bro. Like, it's sheesh. You can't see it at all. I don't know how to fix that. But yeah. Now we have the Kinship Bright Wave Energizing Brightening Eye Cream. I need that. Bro, look at the freaking worse than like the mirror you can't even tell with the freaking camera but anyways wake up your under eyes with his energizing and brightening cream that helps reduce the appearance of dark circles as well as brighten and hydrate your skin it's an energy drink for tired eyes i need that Sheesh. tip for best results gently roll a cold a cool jade roller under your eyes and apply the eye cream did I get a jail ro jade roller last time? I got some sort of roller. I don't know if it's jade. But the deluxe sample, the MSRP of this full size version of this product, 15 milliliters is $32. That's $2 per milliliter. And more, bro. Sheesh. I love yellow. It's cute. Leaping Bunny is certified. What does that mean? Let's see. An illuminating eye cream that contains clinically proven act actives to brighten, hydrate, and reduce the appearance of dark circles. Me. I need that. Red algae, amino acids, improve hydration and brighten dark circles. Vitamin C, ester, a potent antioxidant, delivers radiance while helping it diminish the appearance of fine lines. Chaga mushroom, an adapt adaptogenic antioxidant that debuffs and energizes skin. Clinic rule results, 91% showed clinical improvement in the appearance of dark under eye discoloration immediately after use based on an independent clinical and consumer study of 35 subjects. Last thing in my glam bag. Prestige Cosmetics Waterproof Automatic Eyeliner in Smoke. With one swift flick of your wrist, of the wrist, you can line your eyes in the smudge-proof ultra-pigmented liner. It goes on smooth and stays on all day for a photo-worthy eyeliner look. Tip for smoky eyes, line your lower ash light and smoke it out with an angled eyeshadow brush. Full size MSRP, $8. That's not bad. $8? It kind of looks like the one I got last month. Maybe that's because they just all the sample ones look the same. 
butt just got girl I need a new camera or something the thing about makeup is you should probably be able to see out of your, both of your eyes pretty well but I can't so And of course I'm doing this in like the camera instead of like in a mirror. Can't put on, came on really easily. I did a really bad job. But I want to wear eyeliner more. It's like, this is fun, bro. Let's see. Now I look like a, a 12 year old did their makeup, but... Maybe if I did it in a mirror. But yeah, it was really easy. The tip is a little dull now, but that's okay. That's expected. See what happens when I go like this. Came off on my finger, but maybe I did it wrong. I think you are supposed to blend it and maybe let it dry. Makeup's fun, bro. I don't want to wear makeup, but I'm lazy. But yeah, that's cool. That's fun. If only I could actually see. So that's my July jam. My July jam bag. No, glam bag. Okay, so last night I did the like face wash stuff for the Ipsy July and I filmed it on my phone and now I've been trying to like move s videos from my phone to my laptop and then I can move them to my USB but I'm having a problem because some of the videos are like on iCloud and so that when you like plug your phone in I, I, I have iPhone but then I have a I don't have like a Mac or anything so they don't show up unless they're not in the iCloud when you like go to the file directory or whatever thing. So we love that. Um, and then some of them I filmed yesterday so they weren't in the iCloud yet so they show up. But apparently I don't have enough space on my computer. So I had... Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, actually, yes it does. So I was trying to move stuff. No, okay, it doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, here's my skin. It would really be nice if you could see the iPhone videos, because the iPhone videos are very quality, I think, I feel like. And of course, you have like a freaking shadow from my microphone. But yeah. Skin. I go wash my face again, even though it's morning, I washed it at night. So I do the wash and then I do the moisturizer and the brighten eyes thing. So yeah. let's see what happens. I hate holding it, so it's just like the camera is just on my roommate's bed, and then I'm here. So I just put on the stuff. I don't know how much you can see different. It looks the same in the camera, but I already tell can tell from last night a lot of like stuff that was here is going away something on this side my face just feels so much smoother um i feel like the color has been corrected a lot too we'll have to see about the like under eyes it doesn't look too bad it's been a week and i've actually like done the stuff every day look at that consistency for a video for once i've 
So the things that I tried were the new Co Barrier Culture Cleanser that you cannot see. Yeah. And then the Gold the Fade In the MD Solution Vital Boost Even Skin Tone Daily Moisturizer. that you cannot see <laughs> and then the Kinship Bright Wave Energizing Brightening Eye Cream yeah that's what it looks like I don't like it I think my skin is doing a lot better, especially right after I wash it. I feel like it probably would have better effects if I did it morning and night like it says to, but I only did it at night. I did it morning and night for like one day, but so I did it every night. Um, I don't know about dark circles because like in the, in the mirror you're like this, they're like darker and then like, I don't know. I get tons of sleep, I feel like, but I'm still like tired all the time. I told my brother that and he's like, probably it's your, what you're eating and I'm like, probably. But, so yeah, I feel my face, I think a lot of the like acne I did have was usually like here and here. It's a lot better, it's not completely gone, but I think it might not be acne anymore, it might be just like scabs from acne. So, I love that. Skin feels nice. Probably shouldn't as touch it as much as I do. Yeah, I really... All this stuff is like cool, but like I feel like I'm almost out of this. Maybe I'm just crazy, but I will run out of it at some point and then I won't use it because I don't have money to buy more. So... That's nice. But... And maybe I just have too high expectations, but I'm just like, things that are like that expensive, I expect to like, fix the, my acne quicker or more efficiently, I don't know. Maybe I'm take another week, maybe if I do it two times a day, but there's also like genetics, I'm just like more prone to having acne than other people. But yeah, a lot of what I have now is just scarring and really large pores and scabs from always picking at it, but I've, my chin is always clearer with all the things that I've been doing after I wash it, like in the shower before I wash, it'll be like bumpy, but then after I use the thing, it's not bumpy anymore. I wear glasses, so like I usually have stuff where the glasses are and it seems to be going right now. Should really take better care of my skin if I want to have nice skin. So I think that'll be it. I thank you for watching. Please stay tuned for my other videos. I'm trying stuff, I'll probably Try, hopefully make better videos.